chefs. I don't know what the temperature is going to be when this uh, program airs. However, yesterday was up above 90, and today is going to be pretty much just as hot. And there are, of course, times when you are hungry for something a little bit sweet, but you don't really want to heat up your kitchen by turning on the oven. You can all relate. So today I have a recipe for you that I think you're going to enjoy. It is no-bake chocolate oatmeal cookies. Delicious and nutritious. So our ingredients for today, one stick butter. I've got a half a cup of milk in here, three cups of rolled oats, we're going to be using four tablespoons of uh, unsweetened cocoa, one teaspoon of vanilla, and one half cup peanut butter, along with three cup, two cups, two cups of sugar. So, first step in the process, we are going to melt our butter over here at the stove. Okay, so our butter is just about melted. We are now going to add one teaspoon of vanilla. There's our vanilla. We're going to get four tablespoons of cocoa. One, two, three, and four. Okay, there is our cocoa. We're going to add our milk. We are going to give it a little bit of a stir and then we're going to add our peanut butter. Okay, our sauce that we have made up has begun to boil. It's begun to thicken. At this point we are going to now put in our peanut butter. And we're going to get this peanut butter melted. And once the peanut butter is melted, we're going to begin to be ready to do um, and I'm going to turn the heat off now because that is plenty hot and we just need this to continue melting and then we are going to go ahead and add our oatmeal. Okay. So, got our sugar going in here as well. This is turning into a nice great big thick mixture here. Okay, so we have our chocolate mixture. It's a very thick chocolate syrup gooey kind of thing here. It's got our peanut butter mixed in there. Everything is completely melted. The sugar is melted. The peanut butter is melted. All the ingredients are added. Now, at this point, we are going to go ahead and kind of slowly add our oatmeal. I'm going to sprinkle it in, give it a stir. Going to sprinkle in a little bit more. Give it a stir. And let's get the last of the oatmeal in here. That look good. Everything is mixed, everything is melted, mixed, all put together. At this point, all we're going to do is just scoop it out in approximately walnut sized portions. This is a little bit bigger than a walnut, but it's close enough. And we are going to put it on waxed paper. And as it gets onto the waxed paper, uh, we will eventually put this into the freezer or into the refrigerator and they will be done. Okay. Go. Hi everybody, we are back. Uh, the cookies are done. I put them into their fridge for a little while just to firm up. Here is the finished product. Here is the finished product. And so now Kathy, Anna, and, and Holly, all practicing good social distancing, are gonna try out these.